fly in the sky. Oh! Ah! Yeah, uh... <laughs> All right, guys, we are back here and about to take down, uh, sorry, Nat Junk Moth, Morph Moth. Sorry about that, guys. Gosh. Uh. Morph Moth. Uh. So, yeah, pr pretty cool level here, actually. One of the better junk levels, especially... Okay, I almost panicked there for a second. Uh, so what you need to do here first is Chris. Oh my god, I felt so slow. All right, that took me. That felt felt like a robot there. Uh, but you're supposed to do that, and then like right around Rhea, right here, just to make sure it works. Uh, now we are going to take saw wheel. Uh, I don't really like this the secret. This is probably my least favorite secret in the game because it's like, mm, it's stupid. Like I get you can use the head part for it, but ain't nobody walking around the entire stage just using the head part. So here we are getting our final piece. I don't remember if this reduces your damage by half, but I do remember that it uh it does what what does it do? Oh yeah, that's right. The Giga Crash. So this is the first time in the series where we get access to a Giga Attack, which happens when you take damage, and then you unlock this explosive move. I did not mean to do that. Can I just go up ladder, please? Oh, so, uh, I think I, there's another upgrade that we got that makes us walk up ladders faster. I forgot which upgrade it is. Uh, but we're about to come across a boss here. What's this one week two? I think it's week to Sonic Slicer. I think. Oh wait, no. Wrong wrong boss. Why did it take him two hits? Normally, I just kill him in one hit. Oh my god. This is actually a tougher level of the game because we have like three or four mini bosses. I think it's three though. Yeah, no. The other mini boss I'm thinking of is on Magnus Centipede stage. Uh. Yeah, show up, please. Yeah, pretty, pretty easy. Pretty, pretty easy mini bosses if you know the weakness. All right, just get me out of here. If you guys don't know, actually, the speed burner uh, has little, little. Uh... Actually, you shouldn't be using that. Actually, uh, does this work on this boss? No, it does not. Yeah, we're all armored up here, guys, and we're about to take on Morph Moth. So. What? Can I just hit the boss, please? Thank you. Butterfly in the sky. Oh! Ah! Yeah, uh, 
decently easy boss if you have the weakness. Again, I got hit way too many times. It's been a while since I've uh, played these bosses. Uh, but yeah, so that's Morph Moth. It should be called Junk Moth, in my opinion, because, I mean, Morph Moth, whatever. Man, music in these X series, man. Maybe an X1 through 7. So good. So good. Uh, Dan. So, yeah, we're going to be fighting our final Maverick here. Oh, that's going to be Magna Centipede. One of the best ser uh, stages in the entire series. Uh, because it's like espionage based. Magna Centipede. And when you guys would think Magna, you maybe think Magma, like lava, but wrong. It actually means magnet. And this, and this. Okay, I don't care. Whoa, don't want to get spot. So the gimmick of this stage is that is that there's a uh, security. And of course I got spotted. Does not matter because I am skillful like that using the glitches. Uh, so yeah, we got our last heart tank health bar looking pretty full. Oh, uh, but you guys have to be careful here because a lot of things will catch you off guard. Right there, like it just wants to smush you. If you get caught, and be- Whoa! Like that. Uh, I it's been a while since I've played this level, so it's actually going to take me a minute to get used to it. Uh, but now since we already got the heart piece, it does not really matter. I'm just going to be going through this level like it's nobody's business. I don't even know how to avoid those guys. This boss is weak too. Uh, what is this boss do? Uh, strike chain, maybe? Something. Oh, I missed completely. Maybe it's strike chain. Whatever it's weak to, it dies to in one hit. What? I don't think it's Strike Chain. It might be Sonic Slicer. Yeah, it was Sonic Slicer. It's kind of weird that they had too many bosses be weak to the same thing. Alright, so guys, we are going to want to speedrun this. Whoa! Oh, I don't think we got... Ugh! We didn't get spotted once, so now this boss is going to be pretty weak. I think. I, I'm pretty sure that's how that works. Yeah, it's if you get spotted by the laser, by the by the tracks. This bot, this guy gets harder. I think, because he like adopts your abilities or something. I don't remember what this guy's weak to. I should look it up. Okay, that takes the fun out. Mm, kind of. Going, 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 going. Man, this guy takes forever. He's dead. Not as long as the other green dude, Mega Man X1, like the guardian of the X capsule. That guy is really annoying. I don't care. Look look how skillful I am. Alright, so this boss is actually really annoying if you don't have the the, the weakness for him. Uh, because he will take your abilities and just not give them back to you. Swipe or no swiping. Which is pretty annoying. But there's a way you can stun lock this guy.
So all you need to do is stick in the middle here and just shoot to left or right. Because he's just going to teleport. Look, if you teleport to top left, you just shoot to the right. So it's it's a pretty easy boss fight if you got the weakness. Just trying to be like a ninja. Try to do all that special stuff. He ain't gonna catch me, son. Cause they don't know me, son! Sorry. This fight reminds me of uh, the iguana fight if you have the weakness. Not, not iguana, but stink chameleon. Because all you gotta do is just shoot left or right every time he comes back. I forgot what this does. Oh. Anyway, so that's it. No backtracking. Full run of Mega Man X2 Mavericks with no backtracking. Pretty cool. I'm pretty sure this is the only game you can go without backtracking. So, yep. Yep, do da do. <laughs> so now the X Hunters, they uh, so basically the X, you know, the Sigma Castles are up, or I guess X Hunter Fortress or whatever they want to call it. What do they call it? What do they call it? X Hunter Stage. So yeah, guys, that's it for part. What is that part? One, two, three, four. That's part four. So yeah, next up, we're taking down these. Excellent stages. Catch you guys next time. Peace.